Hey YouTube, this is Obtuse Angle here. This is actually uh, my figure art Sentai uh, Ninja Storm. It's Squid Ninja set. Um, it includes, um, damn, I always say the Thunder Rangers. I guess that's Crimson and, uh, I got no clue. Crimson and Blue or something like that. I have no clue. I'm tired. Hey. It is what it is. It's just the uh, Crimson Color Ranger and the Navy Blue Ranger. I think originally in um <clears throat> in Power Rangers Ninja Storm they were like the um fourth and fifth Rangers I think. But they were more like um hmm, they weren't too much in the middle, they were more like the bad guys, you know, for a bit, you know, before they turned into spoiler part of the team. Alright guys, let's just crack this open but looks like seeing the boxes one side has the uh, navy blue ranger there and other side has crimson and obviously the back usual nonsense on figure arts simple style heroic action option parts molding movable yada 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 but some really nice poses you know I like this, this is one of like their finishing maneuvers the picture on your left um, yeah, so uh, I really enjoyed this uh, series, man. Ninja Storm. Um, yeah, so I used to go to college and come back and, and just you know, tune in and out when you're bored at night. You got nothing better to do, you know? So, yeah, let's see what this baby holds. Well, as you can see, actually, the back of the bar box, the insert's really nice. You know, I have each of their, um, I don't know what that guy's called, insignias, you know, um... Ninja signs, I can't remember. It's been a long time, guys. It's been a long, long, long time. Now it comes in one of these usual trays. The trays here, that's the Ninja Rangers. And this is their uh, parts, you know. That's how it comes. Ah, damn it. Oh, well. Anyway, th these are the option parts here. Uh, you know, you can see uh, both have open hands and... I guess these are ninja hands, famous ninja hands, and I don't know, I think these like posing hands, and these are probably gripping hands, holding weapons, something along those lines, man, you think I remember all this crap? Anyway, it has these, uh, I forgot the names of these things, let's just go with uh, Bontons, I have no idea, I can't remember the hell the X thing if it had a name, I got no clue, man, oh, this is going to be a terrible review already. Some bunny airs and some uh, beetle airs and yeah, jeez, man, what the hell are all these things? Anyway, uh, that's it, really. Let me just crack this baby open. Looks like a gun. I'm glad the color coded, so I guess he has the uh, crimson has the gun and this guy has the baton stick. Whatever the hell. Whatever, man. Whatever. This is going terrible. All right, crack this. And here we have with these guys are the package. Um, they're basically the same mold, really, just different colors. That's why I would say this is different. Um, the helmets are slightly different, but it's probably the exact same mold as I'm looking at, at it. Ooh, that holds his weapon, I guess. So the gun or something along those lines. So the colors are very nice. It's kind of like a matte finish. This is really nice. Excellent job. I mean, really nice look at it. The helmets are shiny, you know, gold is nice. Everything is good, you know, Figure Arts does a good job. Everything is good. Ah, oh, but a little imperfection there, shoot. No, I think it's supposed to be that way, both sides are equal, yeah, anyway. So, uh, back to it. Everything looks nice on both these guys, you know. Everything's painted really well, nice details, you know, once you know what one Figure Arts, you know them all, basically, you know their articulation points. Some are slightly better than others. So let's get a crack in. Uh, it looks down really far. Looks up really far. Head tilts left, right, turns left, right also. So excellent job. Uh, arm moves up. This is really nice texture. Texture is really nice. It has like a chain mail type texture. Really, really nice. You know, I like this here. This hides the joint or allows the joints to move. Really nice. It looks like little chain mail um, sculpted clothing there. So that's really nice. Excellent job, man. Excellent throughout. So it's, uh, arm does go out a little more than 180, 360 if you want. Oh, I like that. Like, yes. 
that's really nice uh, this moves up so that's really good it has a hinge in it uh, let's see the arm also kind of rotates up there too uh, Alba does have like a uh, hmm, a little more than 90 a little more than 90 that's pretty good and the wrist goes around and it's on that little ball joint you know yeah, it's a little ball there you go that's all it is scary when you pull these things out though but what can you do uh, he has a diaphragm joint allows you to tilt side to side goes back a little bit goes forward pretty good you know I, I actually like the diaphragm joints. thinking about this I actually like the diaphragm joints more than the ab crunch it seems like if it done really well a diaphragm joint can do basically everything ab crunch can do it protects the skull better Plus, the diaphragm joint can tilt side to side, you know, that's really nice. I enjoy uh, diaphragm joints. It might it might be my favorite joint right now, you know. Some people like ankle pivots and uh, whatever. I just like, I think I like the diaphragm joints. And anyway, it turns by the waist also and the diaphragm joint. So, that works really well. The legs kick out really far, far to the side. It can go a little bit more if you bring it down a little bit. If you guys want to have that, that uh, hip hinge there. It doesn't, it's not necessarily these figures, I think, because they do pretty well without it. So, upper thigh swivel also, um, double joint and knee really well. Both of the exact same thing, by the way, same sculpt, I think. I'll double check in one second. Uh, I like the way this kind of like seamlessly blends in really nice. Well, sculpt works excellent, by the way, and it has, I don't know, the thigh swivels, yeah, it has a, uh, a, uh, ankle swivel ankle pivot really nicely and it has a toe joint and the ankle does go down and up really far so this is an excellent figure man excellent 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 figure I can't recommend these guys enough you know these are 10 perfect well done figure arts excellent job um, are they the same yeah it looks like the same pants and all that stuff so yeah they basically are the same mold just slight differences in the color and the helmets and the insignias you know, so excellent job, excellent, excellent job. I enjoy these guys a lot, you know. Excellent figures. Same articulation points, I think, between them. Yeah. App crunch head, yeah. Same thing, guys. I need to go through this stuff again. Yeah. Excellent job. Everything's well done, well detailed. Yeah. I mean, fun figures, right, guys? Thanks. That's it. Um. Yeah, if I find some cool poses, I'll put them up at the end of the video. Alright guys, peace. I'm out here. This is just a brief uh, overview of these figures. Alright, bye.